Assalamualaikum welcome to Nasir Soft. In this video I am going to show you how you can install the PostgreSQL in Windows with XAMPP. As I already installed the XAMPP and already <coughs> my SQL database is installed with XAMPP. Okay. So in this video I will show it to you how you can basically install the PostgreSQL with my sql that is already installed in windows so we will uh, basically both use the mysql database and postgre sql database so in this video i will show it to you how you can install the postgre sql with windows in xam so let's start so this link is also mentioned in video description go to that specific link that is postgresql.org forward slash download okay and here choose your operating system i am using the windows so therefore i click on windows and after clicking on this a new page will open that is the windows installer and click on the this download the installer and after clicking this the downloading will start like this so when the downloading will complete then i will show it to you how you can install this the downloading is completed so click on that uh, downloaded.exe file in order to install it and click on yes so here click on next and inside set the path to inside the xam okay so my xam is installed inside the c so just here paste the xam path okay uh, for example the xam folder is here c inside the c the xamp and then okay the folder name and 16 click on next next the directory is inside my xamp okay and next set the password for example any password you want so in my scenario i set it to root retype the password root click on next and default port is this one and click on next next and the installation is basically started it will take some time in order to install the postgre sql in xam so the installation is completed click on finish okay and after the finish so to begin the it shows me to begin please select the installation you are installing okay and uh, this one post free click on next okay so by default uh, we cancel this okay click on yes so our post free is successfully installed so now I will show it to you how you can open the Postgre database. We will enable some extension for the Postgre SQL. So as I already told you that I am using the XAMPP. So inside my XAMPP is installed inside the C. Go to inside your XAMPP folder and here go to the PHP. Okay, which you install and inside the PHP folder inside the XAMPP here open the php.ini file this one okay i am opening it in visual code you can all open it uh, any editor you want and here search the pg sql okay and inside here uh, okay un basically uncomment this extension that is pdo underscore pg sql and one more that is this one that is extension is equal to pgsql okay so uncomment this just removing the semicolon save the file okay and inside your xam restart the apache service stop it and again start it okay as you can see that my my sql is also running and my apache is running now so now i will show it to you how you can uh, we will basically uh, access the postgre sql with my sql okay so my sql is also installed in my pc and now i i am installing the postgre sql okay so as the postgre sql is successfully installed so now i will show it to you on windows how you can launch it so inside this search here basically search the pg admin 
4 that is okay I would judge we can, when you write PG admin okay click on this and it will basically launch the PG admin that is the postgre basically database uh, okay uh, GUI based uh, visualization okay so the on the left side this is a server click on this and by default it uh, a pop-up is basically uh, becomes right here the password which you set at a time of installation click on ok and after that here you can see that the uh, dashboard is open and inside this uh, this is a postgre 16 and here this is the database click on the database and by default the database is installed that is postgres and inside the schema here you can see that if I click on the schema inside the table okay here by default there is no table inside this one so this is the basically by default uh, database now you can create any your database and you can work on this so in this video i show it to you how you can install the postgre sql with xamp while you have already the mysql in your pc so basically we will install the postgre sql database in xam with mysql okay so i hope this video will help you a lot if you have any question regarding to this topic you can comment inside the video comment section or you can uh, write your question in the video description question link mentioned i will answer it to you don't forget to subscribe my channel for more informative videos stay blessed have a nice day this is one of our demo project we have a dedicated team in web developing charts data analysis dashboard developing and many and many more including mobile developing so if you want any similar or different work so in the video description click on show more and inside this this is the contact or order link click on this and inside this link fill your criteria like first name your email that is mandatory uh, you will be contacted or this email address okay which you provide your query messages or you can attach any file including png or zip or anything okay and click on the send uh, click to send okay uh, your message will be sent and you will further contact it on your email